If you want to know the best miniseries, you should definitely watch our picks for the best ones of 2022. Number 10. We Crashed, created by Drew Crevelo and Lee Eisenberg. This take on one of the fastest growing and most valuable startups filled with greedy and narcissistic entrepreneurs tells the story of WeWork, a startup offering modern co-working spaces all around the world. Exploring the company's rise and fall, we discover how the chaotic souls who formed it made it all possible. What, what the fuck was that? I knew he wouldn't get it. That was our S1. Number nine. Body of Christ. <laughs> Pam and Tommy is a biographical drama black comedy television series created by Robert Seigel. Chronicling the turbulent three-year marriage of Pamela Anderson and Tommy Lee, we witness how the infamous actress reached her cult status. With a particular focus on the illegal distribution of the couple's private sex tape, the show dives deep into the horrors of stardom and fame while showcasing its horrifying excesses. People are making copies. You'll we'll figure it out, baby. Figure it out, Tommy. You just... God, you just don't... fucking get it! Number 8 Look at me! You're not gonna die. Let me save us. Moon Knight is a superhero miniseries created by Jeremy Slater. Introducing one of the most intriguing faces of the Marvel Cinematic Universe, we enter the life of awkward loner Stephen Grant, who has trouble with sleepwalking. However, he learns that his nighttime adventures are caused by multiple parts of the same personality. Facing the fact that he is also a ruthless superhero from ancient times, he finds out he is not the only one with a secret. Come on, come on. Thank you for further. Gotcha! Number 7 Under the Banner of Heaven, created by Dustin Lance Black What I'm saying is be here and listen. The gut is wiser than most people think. So suspenseful you will find yourself grinding your teeth. This show follows a foolish and fact-based police detective whose principles are tested when he investigates the murder of a mother. As he dives deeper into the case of a family who was involved with the Church of the LDS, he must question the things he thought he knew to uncover the truth. Right now, we call Reno's morgues, and if they don't have Dan or Ron on ice, we turn around, we head back, because both brothers cannot leave Reno alive. There can only be one. Number 6 The Playlist, created by Christian Spurrier and Luke Franklin taking audiences on a ride to tell the partly fictionalized story of a creation that would revolutionize an entire industry. The playlist follows the birth and early challenges of the Swedish music streaming app, Spotify. Told from very different perspectives in every episode, the show explores how the entrepreneurs and early employees used their convictions, determination, and big dreams to challenge the status quo and change the way people listen to music. You have a fantastic code, but we can not have this here if you can not collaborate. Du kan inte bara hacka Google. Daniel, ta ner den skiten nu. Number 5 The Dropout, created by Elizabeth Merriweather. I don't need your advice on this, Ian. You don't understand the business. And you don't understand the science! It chronicles the life of Elizabeth Holmes, exploring the real-life story of a female entrepreneur from her early teens all the way to her exposure as a greedy fraud. As CEO of health technology company Theranos, she attempts to revolutionize the healthcare industry after dropping out of college. The show touches on the experiences that likely motivated Holmes' deceptions and lies, resulting in a spiral of greed and fear that went too far to make a positive impact on the world. You don't understand the implications of what you're doing. No, you're wrong. I understand exactly what I'm doing. Number four. I was just headed home to crack open a few brewskis. How about you come with me? Dahmer, Monster, The Jeffrey Dahmer Story is a true crime anthology series created by Ryan Murphy and Ian Brennan. Leaving an instant mark in the world of television with one of the most unsettling crime plots you will find. This is a deep dive into the mind of this killer of men and boys. 
We witness his crimes from a shockingly private and intimate point of view, making us part of the scene and chilling us to the bone. What's your name? Jeff. Nice to meet you, Jeff. I'm Steven. Number three. When it's quiet like this, they call it riot quiet, like the calm before a storm. Blackbird is a crime drama miniseries created by Dennis Lehane. Telling a horrifyingly honest and raw story, Blackbird introduces us to James Jimmy Keane. Once a promising rising football player with dozens of scholarships to choose from, he refused them all and became a Chicago criminal instead. Upon being caught and sentenced to 10 years of prison for dealing and illegal firearms, we witness how his witty charm and ability to talk himself out of anything will get him into the most dangerous deal of his life. Did you see anyone in here? No. Something missing? Number two. Shorzy, created by Jared Kiso. Shorzy, do you have something to say or... That's, that's real mature, bud. Shorzy is a sitcom television series created by Jared Kiso. This funny tale of comebacks and belief sees a semi-professional hockey team facing a complete shutdown after losing over 20 games in a row. But as they drive closer to the edge, one of them convinces their coach that they should be put in charge. With a strict mission to change the entire team dynamic and make sure they never lose again, the game is on. What do you want, Shorzy? I want to never lose again. Can you just finish your shit and come talk to me down the hall, please? Oh, you think I'm shitting, Michaels? I should be so lucky. I'm puking and shitting at the same time. This team is... Before we unveil TV show number one, here are some honorable mentions. Schools, rec centers, the city. Pension fund is always bankrupt. It's, it's a poor city. How about we take half the money the cops burn up in overtime and court pay and, and, and turn that back into anti-crime and community-based programming? Hey, 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 I'm on your side. Okay. Have you come to destroy me, Obi-Wan? I will do what I must. Then you will die. I'm Fredrik Svensson. After John Wayne. I don't know Madou. Madou? It's lovely. Say hi to my mom, Liz. Oh, hey. Hello. Hey, Liz. 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 Lovely. Lovely. Number one. We really want you for Michael. Who's we? Well, it's myself and Francis Ford Coppola. The Offer is a biographical drama miniseries created by Michael Tolkien. This true story of the making of a legendary art has something for every film fan. Capturing the making of Francis Ford Coppola's The Godfather through the eyes of Al Reddy, we become first-hand witnesses of how the obsessive producer defined the masterpiece that would change cinema forever. Granting deep insight into the filmmaking business, The Offer is a must-see for every film buff. Do you agree with our list? Please let us know in the comments. If you want to know more about a particular TV show in this list, you can check out our links in the video description. And for more top 10 TV show videos, be sure to subscribe to Community TV.